FNM Bank presents Operation Safe Sweeping Anti Fraud Education. Today's lesson What is malware? Malware is any program or virus designed to disrupt, destroy, or hack a digital device. This typically starts by the user clicking on a malicious link via email, social media message, or post, website link, text message, or online advertisement. Once clicked, the scammer downloads malicious software onto the victim's computer or mobile device to access personal files and track keystrokes. Meet Linda. Linda is 57 years old and loves to start her day with a steaming hot coffee and scrolling through social media to find a topic of interest. Meet Scammer. He has set up many social media posts with interesting headlines to garner interest and encourage clicks. Once a social media user clicks on his link, the victim automatically downloads malware, which the scammer can use to access sensitive information on their device or even set up a ransomware attack. Linda comes across an article with an interesting headline and is about to click on it when she notices that it's a source that she doesn't recognize and that the headline has many grammatical errors. She avoids clicking on it and instead looks at the social media post's comments where people are complaining that the link either didn't go to the article and that once on the web page something began downloading onto their device. Not today, scammer. Linda reports the post to the social media platform and continues with her day. Now, let's meet Joseph who works at the ABC company. He has been working hard and has a break between meetings. He logs onto his favorite social media platform to see what is going on in the world. He sees the same article as Linda did above, but instead clicks on it. As soon as he clicks the link, malware is downloaded onto his work computer. He does not think much of it until he can't access any of his work files. He is then contacted by the scammer who demands he pays $10,000 for a decryption key in order for Joseph to be able to access his work files again. Joseph informs his manager, and after multiple departments spend most of the day working on his workstation, the company ends up paying the scammer, since that is often the easiest and cheapest way to get the files back. Joseph has learned a costly and embarrassing lesson. How can I protect myself from malware and ransomware? Keep operating systems, software, and applications current and up to date. Make sure antivirus and anti-malware solutions are set to automatically update and run regular scans. Never click links in unsolicited emails, text messages, online ads, or social media posts. Carefully review the email and web address and spelling used. Be careful what files you allow to be downloaded onto your computer. Do you want more tips on staying safe? Visit fmb.com safe to learn more about how to protect yourself from fraud. Brought to you by FNM Bank.